We were there as an overflow crowd gathered to say goodbye to a couple who made a very big difference in our community. Funeral services were held today for Ty and Terry Schenzel. They are the founders of the Hope Center for Kids. John Chapman has the story. Every now and then we meet people who operate on a higher plane. We said goodbye to two of those people today. An hour before service began, the parking lot at Christ Community Church is already full. But people still make their way inside to an overflow standing room only crowd. It's clear that Ty and Terry Schenzel touched many people. There were tears, hugs and smiles as pictures walked the crowd through the lives of the couple who gave so much. One of their last gifts, their children, sharing their memories, their thoughts. I miss you so much, it physically hurts. I keep thinking, what do I do? The answer was always to call you. I'm scared to raise my kids. You were gonna show me how. My parents' roots ran deep. Their character was stronger in private than anyone even saw in public. And that is the reason why they were able to live such remarkable lives. Their parents loved to laugh. Their children did not forget. If it weren't for my dad's incessant reminders that he wanted all four of us to speak at his funeral one day, I probably wouldn't be up here doing this. <laughs> Tyler shared the last time he talked to his dad. It was on the phone. No one could have known. And on my way to work Thursday, my dad called. I got to talk to him for the last 10 minutes on my way to work. <laughs> told me how proud he was of me, how much he loved me, which he always did. And he told me that he was ready for the next chapter. Ty and Terry are on their way to the next chapter. With producer Roger Hamer, John Chapman, WOWT 6 News. Obviously, our thoughts and prayers with them as well. A huge story that we've been covering now for the whole week, really impacting the community. Thousands of people mm -hmm. attending today's service. Yeah, great to see. All right. We